Vlogmas day three. Um, I am very dressed up right now. If you would have seen me like at 8.30 because I woke up late. Um, if it was me at 8.30, I would have been like super messy. No makeup. But it's because I have like a presentation to do today with my group for my communication class. We have to like give a speech and dress up and like look nice, I guess. This is kind of my dressing up. I'm just going very comfortable because it's still like a... I mean, it's still like a, a, a class, so you don't have to like go like all suited up and stuff, but did my face. Um, I've been really loving this um, like powder. I heard it a long time ago by Dulce Candy, who was like a beauty guru person, and I heard it and I was like, and it does smell, it smells like grandma, but it's really good. It's just a loose face powder, and you just, I kind of like bake a little. But I don't, I just like put it and it's really good if you have a very oily face. So this morning I woke up really, really late. Uh, I usually have my alarm at 7, 7.10. Um, give myself a little, give myself like a little time to wake up. And then because I have class at 9.30, I woke up at 8.30. And I don't live so far away from campus, but I still kind of do like stop and go and meet my group at 11.30. Which I don't know why we're meeting at 11.30 when we have the speech like at 2. So... I don't know, I think they just want to be like super well prepared. So, catch you guys later after the speech and hopefully I did well and didn't, didn't choke. Okay, so I'm back from class. It went well. I already changed to some my pajama shorts. They're not even Christmassy. I wish I had some Christmassy shorts, but then it would be like really weird because it's Christmas and usually for Christmas it's pants. But anyways, um, it went well. We were practicing at the library like doing our little speaking notes so we can all know what we're going to speak um and you know the time we we had a time from like five it had the speech had to be like five to six minutes long um we finished and we, the time like i said had to be five or to six or seven minutes and we reached our time was 5 19 so we still made it we don't get no more po no points deductive or anything so we're good uh, and that was basically my last lecture slash like class so next week is offline now, so um, I'm kind of, it was kind of good. Um, I was like, yay, no more class, but just final. So, um, but yeah, that was basically it for today. Um, um, like I said, I, I have to kind of, I wanted to clean up a little bit because I have like a lot of that. Um, I just have like my makeup there. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to do some extra credit. That's what I have to do right now. Extra credit in my math homework and then just start studying so. oh my god you guys need to watch jessica jones i literally just finished watching it which watching like the season finale and oh my god it is so good only watch it if you're like 13 no not even 13 it's like a pg-13 it's like a, it's, a, it's like a rated r it's a lot of blood a little bit of sex but it's so good so so good recommend so it's already kind of getting late. I'm just, I decided just to record me taking off my makeup and showing kind of what I use. I used to use the Neutrogena one, and I started using the O8 one, wet cleansing towelettes. And they do take your makeup really easily. Yeah, it says uh, to remove dirt makeup and around your eye, face, and neck. And this also really helps if you wear like Nexus, like from Forever 21, like and off brands basically who that like change colors and stuff and leaves you like that green mark if you get the towel lit and you just like rub it up against uh your skin it really does take it off so i'm gonna just take it off so you guys could see uh the only thing that this kind of lacks on is the mascara like if you see it leaves like under the eye situation so the, that's the only kind of like bad side about it but it's okay, yeah, like I wash my face afterwards and then I just get it again, I get it again and I just, the residue that's left after that, but I mean it's pretty good. So I'm just gonna wash my face already. Um, I've been using with like, um, when Ulta had like their like sale, it wasn't like for Cyber Monday or anything, but it was like just their sale. I saw, so I've always been for like a year, like since the beginning of this year, I think I bought the... Uh, Mario Badusku oil free moisturizer and I'm already running out. This is the two ounce I believe I don't know. 
it's the normal big bottle. But anyways, I, I was running out, so my sister called me and was like, hey, they Ulta has like this huge sale, like everything's like like 25% off or you know just cheaper. She goes, um, tell me what you what you like or what you see and you know I'll buy it for you. So I was like, oh okay, you know, but I wasn't gonna also like take advantage of her. So I was just gonna like ask for my moisturizer but then I saw this little like um like uh treatment like for acne and and it came with those and this the first one is the acne face facial cleanser and this is like a gel kind of deal but it kind of just vanishes it's a really thin material I really like it um you can just massage it in your face and you just wash it off with a warm water and then after that you get a cotton pad or cotton ball and then you get the cucumber lotion which is just like um a toner deal this smells and actually makes your skin really really soft and just feel amazing so after that um you then go on and put in your moisturizer but so i'm gonna do it right now i'm just gonna wash my face because i want to try the drying cream the drying mask it's supposed to also be all for like the acne treatment like all of this was uh a kit to get you started or like sample it um for the acne in like combination skin or something like that I like created my own tripod and now I'm too short. Okay, so now I'm first gonna take off my hair and my face. Uh, I put my water, I like my water a little bit warm. Like you don't see the uh, the, the cleanser it doesn't like foam up and at first I was like am I doing something wrong but it's really and it's also really cool it's literally like if you put like your gel your hair gel into your face because some I was using a um, Neutrogena one and I'll show you I have to show you right now oh no I was using this one and I really didn't like it it was um a cleanser for like stubborn acne but it was like a cream material and I really did not like it. it was too thick I didn't know how to massage it in and I mean I'm like like you see right now massaging it going circles into like the I usually always get my acne around here so I'm massaging it into it. and I would do the same thing with that one but I just didn't feel like it was I was cleaning my skin uh, well so and with this one I feel like afterwards it kind of like goes into like a serum like it's really nice but you have to wash it off so with warm water at my face with the towel you see the mascara the residue is really annoying that's the only thing I have a problem with um, so then I'll just go back with uh, the oil free uh, like remove remover makeup remover but should I get up a little bit let let my face dry a little bit and I also like that it doesn't dry your face out some some um like the Neutrogena this one didn't dry my face a lot but the Neutrogena just like the original formula which my what's your face dermatologist recommended um that really did dry my face uh but my, my skin got used to it afterwards but this one doesn't. I really like it. I can like leave it to, you know, dry naturally or whatever, air dry or whatever, especially in the morning when I'm like getting coffee or just turning on the kettle. Like I, I can do that stuff and it doesn't, I don't have to like run to like do the next step. So I really, really like that. But I'll for sure keep you guys updated when, because this is like a sample, like I said, like, not a sample, but kind of like a trial. Um, to see kind of how my skin reacts and stuff but i feel like this will like last me like a whole month hopefully more but uh hopefully by this like uh christmas i see a difference in my skin and actually give you guys a full review but this is i started when did i start monday so this is my third fourth day because it's thursday today okay so. now i'm just gonna get a little cotton pad 
and I don't pour a lot of it I literally just like what I know my face is gonna get and it's kind of like oily different like different moisturizers just like this and you um, do this going outwards so like I try to Look at that. Look at that. It's gross. And if you can hear that music, it's from my roommate. It, she's literally across from me. So I'm just going to let that air dry. So since I'm going to put the mask, I'm not going to put my moisturizer because I feel like it's like too much cream. Ooh, it's like puffy out. Okay. Oh, I hate putting things. Okay. Oh, it looks like chocolate. Can you see that color? It smells like when people smoke and the smell of it, literally not a good smell, but if it's going to help my face, let's use this part. Oh my gosh, it literally smells like petroleum. not a good smell it literally smells like no it smells like when you go to AutoZone or like any car uh, place lord the smell she my roommate if you can hear the music she has played that song three times already this will be in the third one Like, does she not have like a different playlist? Like, Spotify girl? Spotify! Not my favorite roommate. Just putting it out there. And then my other roommate today gave me attitude. I'm like, um, what did I do to you? <laughs> I, was, I, I was telling her because we've been listening to like this new artist we probably heard at the MTVs. Leon Bridges or Lena Leon Bridges, I think that's how you pronounce his name. Um, and um, he is gonna be on SNL this weekend, so I was like, oh my gosh, you know, like let's watch it together. And she's like with her friend right now, and I've met that friend. I met the friend's good, but um, yeah, I'm like, oh hey, before you go, just wanted to let you know that Leon Bridges is gonna be on SNL. She goes. She goes, tonight, and I go, no, um, it's a Saturday, SNL, and I'm like, ha, 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 right, you know, because SNL has been going on for, like, so many years, and she goes, well, I've never watched the show, I'm like, and I'm like, so you did it, I'm like, you really didn't know about SNL, she goes, no, uh, excuse me, I, like, don't get an attitude, that's, like, a very obvious question and just like an obvious show that everyone knows like how do you not know about SNL like, so I kind of just like okay because, maybe because you're with your little friend but yeah so I was like don't give me attitude I'm like you're the one that doesn't know what SNL stands for I'm like what? but yeah so I'm gonna leave this for 20 minutes and while those 20 minutes are going, I'll get ready. I'll get with uh, started with my writing. <laughs> 